These walls at Fredmore High are reserved for the handprints of graduates. It's an honor to be on these walls because the path to get here is taken by kids that haven't had a whole lot of honors in school. I didn't want to be in school. I didn't like the people. I used to get into fights, cut classes, and when I was at school, I mean, I used to just stay in the principal's office and start commotions. I really didn't think I would like, you know, make it out of like middle school because I just didn't think I could do it mentally. I didn't really care about myself. I didn't really care about what people thought of me. I didn't care about if I finished high school or not. I never planned a future for myself because I never planned to have a future at all. I went through a couple struggles and gave up on myself a lot. That's a common theme here. A bunch of kids that at one time or another thought school wasn't for them. Then, they found the Fred Moore approach. When I got here, my, um, my science teacher, my math teacher, they were all striving to just get me where I needed to be because I was way behind. Their communication is on point. They're very verbal with uh, how much they care about you. If, you know, if they see you struggling or something, they're gonna come up to you and they're gonna be like, hey, let me help you with this, whether it's like family life or it's about school. They're super involved and just trying to get you on the right track. Even when I felt like I couldn't do it, they knew I could do it. So they kind of like pushed it. My teachers have helped me like figure out how to reach my goal, like what I have to do, what I need to get finished, and what I need to work on to get to that goal. It's a slow go. It, it's not like they flip immediately and, you know, bond with you. You have to build that trust and be willing to and be patient. <laughs> that seems to be the secret. <laughs> the teachers boost like my confidence and everything, they're like cheering me on as I go. Like, don't give up or anything like that. And I just keep going. So to have someone show you so much love and also be stern with you and be like, you have potential in this life, let's make the best out of it and set you up to succeed. That kind of love makes you have hope and go so far. Hope, that's what these kids really learn while earning their diploma. They learn to have hope in a place that used to be reserved for hate. I am extremely happy. I would not be where I was or where I am today without Fred Moore. If it wasn't for Fred Moore, I probably wouldn't be in school. I probably would be working or something. School just wasn't for me. And I realized it's just the environment. That environment's not for me, but this one is. The fact that I can, I'm just thinking about going to college now and I'm gonna graduate soon, it's just, mind-blowing to me because I never thought of that. The day of my graduation, actually, I cried. I cried because I made such a turnaround. It's just like, wow, I made it. I actually succeeded at something. It's amazing what a little success can do. These kids are now excited about their future and ready to leave their mark on the world after they've left their mark on this wall.